how do you manage that one, mate? Oh, I don't actually know. I've tried it so many times in my career and it's never come off. Goals always had a little look over his shoulder, but I thought, I don't know why today. I thought, fair, on my, on my side, I should have scored a few goals today, but hey, I can't score every game. But I thought, let me try and think out of the box like a magician there. And I thought, you know what? Let's, let's try it. And when I saw the ball go down, I was thinking, like, nah, no way. And I think in my head, I thought, the ref's going to blow up here for a reason, like give a free kick or a side. But I was like, when he just didn't, I was like, all right, I've actually won the ball back here. And I saw Scott come in. When it went, it, did it, it felt like the winner. I did. It just it felt like it felt like we deserved it massively. And yeah, I, I couldn't even tell you. But I'm telling you, I will not be trying it again for a long time. <laughs> you have tried it a few times this season, actually. We've seen it at Portman Road, but today you just had a feeling. Yeah, I always like you always hang about, and the goalie always look over his shoulder. Today, he just I don't know. I must have been extra quiet. I don't know what the hell was going on. He just dropped it, and I thought I've got to give it a try. But yeah, do you think it was the least we deserved as well? Massively. Yeah. Yeah, we played some good football. Should have been, like I said early on, first half, should have been up one up for my chance there. But I'm critical of myself and I should be scoring them. But as long as I can work hard and help the team like today get something from the game, I'm happy. Yeah. That's important as well, isn't it? Because you've scored obviously a lot of goals this season. We need everyone chipping in. Yeah, that's it. Now I've got Chapman's come off the bench scoring. Yeah. Hopefully more and more weeks come, more and more players start scoring as well and then we start climbing this league again. Yeah. You're critical of yourself, as you say, but you kept going. It's a never say die attitude almost. Massively. I run, I run till I can't run no more. I can't breathe. Like, still probably saw me in there. I just hit the deck. I had to. So I couldn't wait for the whistle to go, but I thought I knew just run until you hear the whistle go. And that's my mindset. Just keep working as hard as possibly can. How important is it as well that we start to see the impact of players off the bench? Because there feels like there's a good squad depth here. Massively. It's fitness levels now. We've got everyone in the team now is fit as each other. We've got players on the bench who you know, if he goes off, he's going to come on and do the exact same job as the other person. It's, and it's respect. It's confidence in your play. It's... It's just everyone, we've now all found that team spirit now and it's now starting to build massively. When you get a late goal like that, it contributes to the team spirit as well. How much of a lift could that give the place before Tuesday? Massively now, like all eyes are choosing now to go and get that win rather than the draw. So it's for us now, we crack on and focus on Tuesday. Yeah, we don't want to look at the league position too much at this stage, but you've got Doncaster coming here, got to see it as an opportunity. Massively. Yeah, that's one now we look, look, look forward to on Tuesday night now to go and hopefully get a win against Donny. Well played, Macca. Thank you, mate.